When we started looking for homes together, were you okay with... I never even asked you <laughs> when well, we started you know, looking for Do you know houses. how it kind of happened? You don't even remember, I don't think. You just drove by this house, I think, and you saw the model home, and you just called me while I was at work with your mom saying, hey, I looked at this home, you should see it. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That's how that. the whole thing started. And then we started looking at homes in other neighborhoods and we came back to yes. this neighborhood, looked at the same house you called me from and you were like, we're building this. He's the personality in our family that everybody just gravitates to. If Aaron's not around, the party's not happening kind of thing. Uh, so yeah, he's, he's my whole heart too. He used to watch the television show Young Can Cook. We would come home from work and the house would smell like onions and Worcestershire sauce. And he'd tell us he was trying out something that Young Can Cook had done on his show, so he was going to be a chef just like Young Can Cook. She's very fortunate. She's getting a good cook. I always tell her that. I said, God, I'm envious of you. My husband doesn't know how to cook, but Aaron does. So we try to invite him a lot to the house and Erin will cook. <laughs> He's real good. So I know she'll be taking care of it if anything was to happen to us. You know, he's a great guy. With regard to the marriage, normally I, I kind of get concerned about young people getting married um, because I don't think there's adequate preparation or they haven't had an opportunity really to experience the trials and tribulations of a long-term relationship. Not here. These two people know each other. They've known each other for a long time. They've been together for a long time. And they're both really sound thinkers, responsible citizens. And I, I truly believe that if any sort of marriage relationship is going to work, it's going to be this one. Would you give me a girl? That thing I wanted to tell you about Lindsay, as soon as she woke up. McDonald's, <laughs> McDonald's. That was her favorite food. And what did she order? Five hash browns. That's it. No biscuits, no eggs, no pancakes. She wanted five hash browns. Well, on the Cinderella, she, um, she rehearsed at home day in and day out. All the parents are going to participate. I'm like, okay. And then they were like, well, go ahead. the carriage is going to be a cardboard box. And I was like, not for my princess, it's not. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? I'll take care of the carriage. So we put it together, we built it, and it was difficult, but the whole time I had a blast doing it. We were just very girly at a young age, and we would dance in hallways, we would dance in our room. Lindsay was always singing and and we still, even when we got in our 20s and we were old enough to go downtown, dancing was our thing. That's kind of always been our thing. Dancing in diapers, dancing in heels. That's, that's what we did. Well, you know, he's always had a great heart and that's always been the case, you know. He's always concerned, has a lot of empathy for, for everybody. You know, he's been kind of carefree and he's kind of, when he was younger, he was just a lot pretty reckless about stuff. But his loyalty, uh, his empathy, you could always see. I still can't believe I stood in line for four hours to get tickets to a free show. But I just love that we were both standing in line but had no idea. That's when I saw you like coming up from the yeah. entry. I just walked right up in the middle though and like walked right up to you. It was so crazy because we hadn't seen each other for like 10, ten years, years before that moment. Yeah, and I was like, that's Aaron freaking Lord. That's Lindsay Rodriguez. <laughs> Yeah, I know that was crazy. Aaron and her together, they make a great couple. I always tell them, I said, you know what? I know y'all drink wine and eat cheese. Y'all 
Y'all are just so like the wine and cheese. They go together. <laughs> they really do. It's amazing how they complement each other. I'm happy for Lindsay and Aaron. They're going to make a great couple. You want me to say something? To us. To us. Thank you for this beautiful meal. Of course. I love you. Thank you for this beautiful life. Yeah. <laughs>